Shanghai on Monday reported the first deaths linked to the city's ongoing COVID-19 outbreak, China's worst since the start of the pandemic, as the rise in cases in eastern China and the country's commitment to a zero-COVID approach prompted more cities to impose pandemic restrictions despite concerns. That's the total number of COVID-19 deaths that China has reported since the start of the pandemic. When adjusted for population size, China is one of the lowest pandemic death rates of any country, below zero. 5 per 100, 000 population. In comparison, the United States has reported more than 300 deaths per 100, 000. Shanghai has reported more than 300, 000 COVID-19 cases since the start of the current outbreak in late March. While authorities began to loosen some curbs last week, most of the city remains under lockdown. The stringent three-week long lockdown has caused some anger and discontent among the city's residents due to several issues like food shortages and stringent quarantine rules. Outbreak in Shanghai has been fueled by the highly infectious Omicron subvariant known as BA, two which appears to have blunted the effectiveness of China's lockdown and mass testing efforts. Despite growing criticism about its effectiveness in the face of a highly transmissible virus, Beijing has vowed the sip of its zero COVID strategy. Last week Chinese President Xi Jinping backed the approach stating that prevention and control work cannot be relaxed. Zive's stance was endorsed in an editorial published in the state-run People's Daily on Monday which said the strategy was correct and effective and called on the Chinese people.